It's a young Christoph Duda. Congratulations. Um, share us your, uh, your feelings. How do you feel? Yeah, I'm of course extremely happy to win the event, even though I'm obviously not satisfied with my style, especially in the last round. I just, I guess I got rid of energy and started playing kind of, kind of badly, but um, luck was clearly on my side in the last round. And, um, yeah, so I'm happy I managed to win. Yeah, our commentators Fiona and Srinath were saying that you are always very confident, very calm when you play. But we saw some of your emotions in the last round. So, what do you really felt uh, when you looked like you thought you could still win the tournament? Yeah, I started blundering, but I was having like, um, like I, I mean, I got a lot of points, so uh, it didn't matter at first. But then I started to. Um, Okay, against Roy Bali, I was actually lucky to to draw, but also he was lucky because he made an illegal move and uh, he didn't lose. I just got an extra minute. Um, so yeah, and I mean, and the afterwards I started to. Uh, I mean, match against Klekowski was of course crucial because uh, I had one and a half uh, point advantage, which should be more than enough with four rounds to go. But. Um, yeah, but somehow I lost with white. Like uh, I, I thought I was pressing with white, but then I mean I lost so, so easily, and that was frustrating. And with black, I also got um, into some prep uh, of his. Of, uh, so um, yeah, I was fortunate actually to to get away and make a draw. And yeah, in the last round, I mean it was clearly uncomfortable. But uh, once I won with black, I no, thought it's like, you, yeah. you know almost match over. <laughs> yeah, but and with White, once he played, you know, nice six and a five in the second move, I thought, okay, come on, it's gonna be like winning 25 moves. But and then I started, started, started to play so poorly that still think had uh, a lot of chances actually, maybe even to pull it off at some point. But um, I mean, the end game, but good. Um, yeah, but somehow I miss, uh, misoperated uh, the end game. I mean, the Rungan game was one for him, which I didn't, didn't see from my fire. Uh, yeah, but I was lucky that uh, Magic also lost uh, in, the, in the last round, so <laughs> I mean, that was very fortunate and kind of resembles me of London candidates 2013 when Magnus also lost with white pieces in the last round, but was fortunate enough that uh, Vladimir Kramnik also, also lost against Ivanchuk. There were so many rounds, right? 22 games. Uh, how do you feel about this to play with one opponent with two colors? This is something new, right? Uh, for, for the chess players. What do you think about it? Yeah, I like the idea, to be honest, but uh, yeah, 22 rounds is a lot of rounds. <laughs> yeah, and I mean, um, yeah, I should have prepared bet better, I guess, uh, physically, because uh, yeah, I was very successful and was satisfied with my play, but as I said, after some, uh, I mean, the closer to the end, the games were terrible, so yeah, but I think it's a kind of nice format and also, okay, the longer the distance is, the uh, less the lesser of uh, of lag, yeah, and it's all about skills. So, um, yeah, I mean, I I'm very happy right now. All right, um, I, I bet you have seen your photos on the banners in around the city, Katowice. It's everywhere. So, how do you feel about this? Uh, it gives you some pressure, or you feel very confident with that, or just uh, tell us how to be to be a star? Like, what's the feeling of that? Yeah, I haven't seen them myself, right, uh, like uh, only on photos. So, <laughs> um, yeah, I you know, don't like um, I mean, being being a star, kind of. <laughs> I mean, uh, you know, I like my privacy. But um, yeah, I think this event is very nice here. Uh, um, so I'm happy. I know I could like um, I don't know like uh, make more people you know playing here so um, in, in that aspect I'm totally fine and happy. Uh, here we have so many people so many kids just uh, around you they are waiting to make photo with you or get an autograph clearly you are their ro ro role model you had also a role model when you were a kid like you wanted to to play like any particular uh, particular chess player or how was that? Um, there wasn't such player in Poland, I believe. Um, yeah, of course, I was inspired by the very best players uh, in the world, but I didn't have a chance, I mean, a lot of chances to meet them personally back, uh, back in days, so back in time. So, 
Um, yeah, I think it's nice to have an idol, but um, <laughs> yeah, I'm just happy, you know, that I can promote chess in Poland and um, yeah, because it's a nice game, you know. <laughs> um, so um, yeah, I encourage viewers also to play chess because uh, it's not about, you know, uh, playing chess itself, but about developing some useful skills in life. Uh, so um, yeah, in that, in that respect, chess is totally cool. Well, uh, you or you just became a European champion. Are you also planning to uh, become a world champion in Blitz? Yeah, why not? Um, actually, I uh, didn't win. I think uh, European Blitz, like ever, I was second. And yeah, so so I so I'm happy that I uh, pulled it off today. Um, yeah, and I was also a vice champion in Blitz, so yeah, it would be wonderful, of course, so, uh, to win, even even Rapid, <laughs> not necessarily Blitz in Warsaw. And this, of course, a uh, very big event that actually, you know, what uh, Blitz and Rapid uh, Championship is, uh, is held in Warsaw. Yeah, and uh, you're probably happy to have this in your country, because uh, you have so many supporters, and your biggest supporter is your mom, and everybody knows about that, so... Uh, have you have you met her now today? Uh, have have she already congratulated you? Yeah, she's been next to me like the entire day today. So, um, yeah, I mean, of course. Um, okay, now I'm grown up, you know, but <laughs> but maybe it's not that much of uh, that that important. But uh, yeah, back back, uh, I mean, a couple of years ago, it was kind of crucial, and of course, it's very. Um, very important, you know, to have a um, supporter. I mean, I mean, the parent who supports uh, a child in like any any area in life, because it's kind of um, you know m kind of must if uh, a child wants to uh, achieve something in, in, in anything. So um, yeah, in that um, in that sense, of course, I'm very grateful to my mom. Um, yeah, and she uh, definitely had difficult time <laughs> with me today, uh, especially in the last round. So. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming here once again. Congratulations for the for the victory and for the new title. And um, let's end this year with another title, and you can call it a year the best year, right? Yeah, for sure. Thank you. Uh, we are